the British Army Challenger II main battle tank fleet is due to receive a base overhaul as part of its standard in-service maintenance schedule. This will be followed by a series of automotive upgrades under Heavy Armor Automotive Improvement Program, which ensures the British Army Challenger II vehicles remain highly effective and capable until Challenger III enters service. Once upgraded, the vehicles will be delivered to RBSL who will deliver the Challenger 3 program under the £800 million contract secured by Defence Equipment and Support. They will use the modified vehicles as the trial and demonstration platforms. As part of the base overhaul process, each Challenger 2 will be stripped to bare hulls and subjected to ultrasonic inspection, weld repair and repainting. Every component is removed and inspected for serviceability to ensure that the vehicle is as close to new as possible when it is rebuilt. The Heavy Armor Automotive Improvement Program upgrades will then introduce new components to the rebuild process to improve its suspension, engine, and transmission. Brigadier Anna Lee Riley, head of the Defense Equipment and Support Vehicle Support Team, said, This is an exciting moment for defense. We've been committed to keeping the Challenger 2 tanks in service over the past 23 years, and we're looking forward to using our expertise to manage the necessary upgrades to pave the way for the Challenger 3. To reduce waste and increase overall in-service platform availability, components that are replaced by the Heavy Armor Automotive Improvement Program Upgrade Pack are checked for serviceability, repaired where necessary, and returned to the supply chain to help the residual fleet of Challenger 2 tanks supported until 2025.